Hey y'all, in today's video from the 2024 NSRA Street Ride Nationals, I got a very cool 1933 Ford I think y'all are gonna like. Let me get the camera turned around, we'll take a quick look at it. Justin, how are you, brother? Good, man, yourself? Oh, outstanding. I dig this. You tell Thank me you. there ain't much about it, but for all the crazy stuff you did, I, I like this one. Uh, Understated it, cool. Yeah, it, it's kind of bringing it back to the street ride days, to be honest, you know? It's uh, kind of modern, kind of old street ridey looking. We did do quite a bit. This is obviously a fiberglass body. It was all one piece, so we had to cut it all apart and make it, you know, come apart and go together like a normal car. Right. Um, and we stuffed that uh, big old Hemi in there with that transmission, and it's it's borderline too much motor for this car because <laughs> they is don't that weigh much. New school Hemi in there? Yeah, it's a new one. And then we three D printed the cowl piece, the, uh, the valve covers. We did. Um, there's just a bunch of little little things that we did on this thing to bring it into the modern days and hide the old way of doing things right. if that makes yeah, sense yeah, yeah, yeah. i got you so no and i think that's exactly what you did was you brought it into and not too modern like you know it's not over modern and, and i don't even know that i'd say it's modern but yeah it's just cleaned up enough you got small wheels on it you don't have big wheels on it i like what dan did with the treads on the, yeah. on the running boards uh, anytime you put a Hemi in anything, that's always a good thing. Sure, yeah. Yeah, it's a 32, so there is no room in the interior to sure, be doing much sure. craziness there. Is it yeah. a chassis car, or what do you do there? Yeah, so it's actually sitting on a chassis. Um, so it's got nine or 8.8 eight rear end. I don't remember what trans, but it's from Bowler. Uh, and then the, the new Hemi and then the, the custom radiator is in there. What color is it? Uh, I don't remember the, the name. We, we tweaked a, I think it was a Ford color, but we tweaked it and made it a little more deeper. Um, have swap out oh. make it easy to touch up if anything ever happens which he's going to drive it and he lives on a farm so okay yeah no he's... stone chips will be prevalent yep. yeah yeah no i think simple really worked on this one well thank you i like the brown wheels with enough chrome not a ton of chrome on it but just enough to pull it out yeah and like i said anytime you put a hemi in anything that's cool yeah yeah and um yeah i don't know what else you could do there again you don't want to do too much to these cars because they were cool when they came from Ford. Right. that's why they're still doing them now right yeah the uh, the body lines on them speak for themselves right. so does it still have a rumble seat or is that a trunk nope it's a trunk now okay. so yep everything's in there battery uh, electronics so you can still put stuff in there if you want and now nah, it's it's a cool little car it wasn't a, a big budget builder or anything super crazy but he wanted a nice driver that uh has our custom stamp on it you know so i think he killed it <laughs> we did something with it right, no i think you did i think you sat out and you were like is this a i think you might be surprised by how impressed i am but no i asked you i said when did you do that car you're like oh it just came out and i'm like well that's why i hadn't seen it yeah uh, yeah yeah it literally just got done before we left uh put an ac line on it charged it drove it and here we are dude no, I like it. Nickel's paying fast. Thanks, Rock's yeah. another one. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> so there you go from the 2024 NSRA Street Rod Nationals. A very cool 1933 Ford Street Rod. Hope you all enjoyed it. See ya.